What's up everyone? Welcome to yet another video. Scott McLeod here. Coach Scott McLeod, certified personal trainer, kicking it off with some anabolic hot cereal. Back at the table where a lot of my YouTube videos typically begin, but it's been a while. It feels good to be back. It's currently Friday, February 18th at 5 o'clock in the morning. Now I have today off. I'm driving on over to Mount Snow in Vermont. It's about a three hour drive from here. Meeting up with the big homie Mike. Without further delay, let's get after it. Okay, as I'm sure you just saw, this weather is absolutely awful. It's like 50 degrees, it's extremely windy, and it's downpouring rain. It is February 18th, we're breaking records for highs of warmth, and this weather is just crazy. It's unfortunate because we bought lift tickets a while ago, or at least I bought my lift ticket a while ago. I'm not sure if Mike has a pass or not. It is what it is, we're gonna try to make the best out of it. It's supposed to stop raining over in Vermont, so. We're just gonna zip on over there, three hour drive, long trip, got the car packed, let's go. Okay, so we made it, and that 60 degree, crazy, warm, windy weather, well, by the time I got to Vermont, it actually started snowing just a little bit. I know, absolutely crazy. That's just weather in New England for you. Now, the conditions, they obviously weren't great, but they also weren't the worst I've ever experienced. Take a look. Okay, so what an absolutely crazy turn of events. This morning, as I'm sure you saw in the previous clips, when I woke up, it was 60 degrees and it was downpouring rain. It felt like it was 
late spring, to be honest. As soon as we get on over to the mountain, Mount Snow in Vermont, the rain had already stopped and it was extremely windy and we got some crazy weather coming in. It dropped from about 50, 60 degrees all the way down to the high 20s, low 30s. And then we did even get some snow at some point. So the conditions, they weren't the greatest, but they also weren't the worst that I've ever experienced. I'm just happy that the rain stopped, that I was able to get on over there, meet up with my buddy and get some rides in. I took time off, I bought the lift ticket well in advance. It just was the best timing for me to go on over to the mountain with travel being at full force and all of the crazy busy things that I do on a regular basis. So we bought these tickets well in advance and obviously we can't control the weather, but crazy turn of events. We got a ton of runs in and it was a great day. A great day, no doubt, but also a long day. I was up at 4 a.m. I was hitting the road at about 5, 5.30 in the morning. Three hour drive on over to the mountain. Doing another three hour drive to get back to Quincy, the South Shore of Boston. We are on the mountain from about 8.30, 9 o'clock in the morning until pretty much the very last chair at 4 p.m. So roughly seven, maybe seven and a half or eight hours on the mountain, about six in the car in total if we add three hours there, three hours back. So it does make for a long day, but it definitely beats signing into work. Take a day off, meet up with a buddy, shred the mountain, get after it, and have some fun. Finally made it home. It's been a real long day. Protein shake in hand, protein shake acquired, MTS Nutrition Fruit Cereal Way, link in description. Also gonna be munching on some sour strips, the best sour candy out there. Shout out Max Tuning. If you enjoyed this video, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. As always, I drop at least one video a week every Wednesday, 10 a.m. Eastern time, and I'll see each and every one of you in the very next video. Smooth, <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>